Hi, in this video, we're going to show you how to increase the refresh interval for your email when you're using Gmail. So by default, Gmail will refresh your uh, email screen every so often. Not quite sure of the exact time, and I don't think there's even a way to change it. But of course, while you're in there, you could click on the refresh button here to check for new email, or you could actually, you know, refresh the whole page itself if you want to do that way. Sometimes actually refreshing the page itself will work better than hitting this refresh button here. But if you need it to refresh faster than that, then there's a way you could do that with a uh, Google Chrome extension, and that's called Easy Auto Refresh. So to do that, all you got to do is go to the Google Chrome, Google Chrome Web Store, I should say, and then find it and then add it to Chrome. I'll put a link in the description. And so if you ever click on Add to Chrome and it gets stuck on checking and it kind of frees up your browser, what you could do is go to Chrome, go to your Settings, Advanced, system and then uncheck this use hardware acceleration where available then install it then you can come back and turn it back on again so that's if you have that problem which i seem to have a lot on this one computer here okay so click on add to chrome and it's going to um, add the extension for the account you're logged in as when you're using it so we're going to click on add extension okay and then you'll kind of get a screen here telling you what it does so there's a free version and a licensed version for 30 bucks a year, which does, has a lot more features, which you'll see here, which I'll show you in a second. So once you have it there, you'll have your extensions up here, and you'll see Easy Auto Refresh. And if you want to pin it to the uh, bar up here, you could do that. And then you'll have it right there to use. So let's close this out, go back to Chrome. So it works per web page. So we're going to click on it to activate it. And then there's the default 10 second interval, and you can change it to whatever you want. And here's the advanced options, such as any page on Google.com or mail like Google.com, I should say. You know, random, clear cache at the same time, show a longer countdown, because by default, only even if you set it for 30 seconds, it won't show the countdown until it gets to 10 seconds. Uh, refresh all tabs that you have open, and some other options as well, too. So we're just going to show you the, the free one here for now. And then if you like it, you could buy it for 30 bucks a year and, and go from there. So we're going to click on Start. And you can see it has a really small countdown there. Five, four, three, two, one, refresh. And so like I said, if we change this to, let's say, 15 seconds, click on Start. It's not going to do the first five seconds until it gets down to 10, 9, 8, and so on. So like I said, it just shows the last 10 seconds by default. And then we'll refresh here in two seconds. And now you see if we go to another page here, it's not activated, so you have to activate it per page, which is a good thing because you don't want it refreshing every time you go to a new tab in your browser because that would be kind of ridiculous. So once again, and then if you want to turn it off, you just click on it again, stop, and then if you want to remove it, just click on these three dots, remove from Chrome, and then it's gone, and then you can you know, go back to the old-fashioned way of refreshing or waiting for Google to do it itself. So once again, easy auto refresh, install the uh, extension and just go ahead and turn it on and set your settings and see how it works for you. And if you like it, you could buy the uh, full version and I'll put that in the description and give it a shot and see how it works. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.